to focus on the Scorpion King, the first one of the first kings of Egypt, going back to 3150 BC, uh, Dynasty Zero. You know, we don't even have the first dynasty yet. Uh, I'm Pat McGovern. I'm from the University of Pennsylvania Museum, and I'm the scientific director of the Biomolecular Archaeology Project. Scorpion was a, a king in southern Egypt who uh, was buried in a very spectacular way. And he was buried with all the things you might expect, uh, not just uh, in this life, but intended for the afterlife. So he had jars of beer, the clothes he would need in the afterlife, but also wine, which uh, was not produced in Egypt uh, because they did not have the grapevine. It had to be imported from the Jordan Valley and vicinity. And he had 700 jars of wine, about 4,500 liters of wine that he took to his grave. And we did the analysis of this and were able to show that it included lots of uh, Levantine spices uh, like savory, thyme, coriander, and also figs. That's the only example we know of a, a figged wine. It really uh, illustrates how the royalty and the upper class were very much attracted to special fermented beverages. And so if you couldn't get it uh, locally, you would import it. You know, it's sort of like today when we want to show off to our friends, 